Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Halloween is round the corner. So today we are going to make a Halloween special project. So now let's get started. First we'll start with the code of the player. When the flag is clicked, then we'll go to controls and take forever inside forever the if block. Now we'll create a new variable named lives. In the beginning, set lives to 5. That means full lives. Switch costume to scared cat. If the key right, left, up and down pressed. So do it four times like this. If arrow right pre pressed, point in direction 90 towards the right. Change X by 7. Duplicate this for left arrow pressed. Point in direction minus 90. That means the opposite direction. And change X by minus 7. That means it will go towards the left. If key up arrow pressed, change y by 7. If down arrow pressed, change y by minus 7. If on edge, bounce. Now we'll do another column of coding. When the flag is clicked, we'll go to variable section, set lives, set time to 30 this time. That means we have 30 seconds time to survive the killer in the round 1. Forever, wait 1 second, change time by minus 1. That means it will work as a timer. Now we'll do the coding for the ghosts. When the flag is clicked, start sound dun dun dun. And then we'll go to variable section and take show variable time. Show, switch costume to flying ghost, go to x this and y this. Forever, go to motion section, glide 1.5 seconds to the player. That means it will follow the player and the player has to survive from the killer. Broadcast a new message named rest. That means we'll get a 5 minutes rest time. Stop this script. When I receive rest, set lives to 5. Hide variable time. And now we'll take show variable time. Like this. Now we'll duplicate this code of when the flag is clicked and take it as by removing it. We'll remove the block when the flag is clicked and we'll take when I receive next round. Start sound this and then the other code will change it to switch costume to Annabelle and broadcast a new message named you win. Now we'll do the coding for the screens when the flag is clicked. We'll go to motion section and take go to x0 and y0 the center of the screen and hide itself. When I receive q win, then we'll go to the event section and take when the flag is clicked forever if equals to sign if time equals to 30 then Repeat until time equals to zero. Place on clock ticking until done. Duplicate this code. If time changes to if touching player, then we'll go to the controls and take if block. Starts on boom cloud and change lives by minus one. If time equals to zero, then broadcast. A new message named game over that the player loses. When I receive game over, change it to when I receive rest, switch costume to happy, duplicate this when I receive next round, switch costume to scared. Now we're recording for the screens. Go to front layer again and show itself. Start sound, tada until done. Now we'll duplicate this code for the game over screen. Switch costume to costume 2. Place on oops until done. So like this, now we can test our project. The clock is ticking and we have to survive the ghosts. We have 30 seconds time and our lives is full right now. lives is minus one we have only four lives now only five seconds left 
Yes, and now the cat is happy because it has got a 5 seconds break. Oh no, Annabel is now alive. Now let's try to survive Annabel. It might be difficult because the mode is difficult. Oh no, our life has now decreased. Life equals to 3 now. Run. Only 5 seconds left. Four, three, two, one, zero. You win. Happy Halloween. So if you like the project, don't forget to like, share and subscribe. For more such videos, don't forget to put the notification bell on. Bye. Meet you next time.